For Michelle Root, the heartbreak of losing her daughter Sarah two and a half years ago is easier. Knowing the blood, tissue, and organs Sarah donated after she died helped save lives. It is incredible because that's the person she was. She was giving, caring, and would help anybody. It didn't matter. At the same time the Roots lost their daughter, Dan Griffin from Elba was in desperate need of a heart transplant. When he and his wife got the call a heart had been found, a blizzard was bearing down on the state. It took a combined effort of total strangers and the NSP to get Dan to Omaha, where the heart transplant was a success. I remember telling my family, I think he's someone that received Sarah's heart. But for two and a half years, it was just a hunch, until this week, when Nebraska Organ Donation connected the two families. We kind of, in a way, knew it was each other, but without that confirmation, you know. So now that we have it, it's like two incredible stories that came together. For the first time since that fateful night in 2016, Michelle will be able to listen to Sarah's heartbeat. She had the most beautiful, amazing heart. And to have somebody continue on with that means a lot. And helps with the healing process. Mix of emotions, you know, you're so excited, you're so um, saddened at the same time. But it's such an incredible journey that both sides have been through that this is going to be a positive. Two and a half years later, Dan hasn't had any problems with Sarah's heart. He's excited to meet the mother of the young woman whose sacrifice is why he's still here today. KETV's Michelle Bandor will be there on Sunday when the two meet. Back to you.